All right, is this thing on? Oh yeah. <laughs> All right, so this is completely unscripted and um, off the cuff, however you want to see it or say it, but basically this one is going to be about something I've been doing for a number of years, but uh, haven't really sat down to actually think about what I've been doing. Everybody wants to change their uh, life and person. I, I, I should say this correctly, not everybody does. A lot of people need to. The plane, the plane. Um, so I guess from the heart, it's a lot of people don't know they need a change and they think, hey, accept me as I am. I'm this uh, perfect person and whatever else. No, you're a perfect you, but it doesn't mean you're perfectly ready to be with somebody or um, even to be the best person you can be. So, as the title states of this video, it's about reprogramming yourself. First of all, you have to look at yourself and be willing to um, see that you need to improve and you need to be okay with that and not look at it as a negative. You have to then want it and commit yourself to making these changes daily. It's definitely not something that takes an infinite amount of time or a small amount of time. Each aspect of you that you're going to try to change is uh, going to take different times and different levels of energy for you to do them. So accepting that you have these imperfections and you'll never be perfect is the first thing but trying to iron out these things that could that are holding you back from being an even more or a greater person is uh is what you're trying to accomplish and it's not easy because you have to really sit down and have a talk with yourself and lord knows that a lot of other people most people you meet are not perfect and not trying to be and you should also not try to be perfect but strive to improve um, be the try to find the best person you can be um, just as you are now you're better than hopefully you're better than where you once were and for all those who are watching this or interested you should be trying to find your way to that that final level where you have all those things are about you that are ironed out and once you get yourself there, um, you can devote other energies to other things. Um, maybe understanding, you know, your significant other or your children or your friend or doing more charity work, whatever it is, you should always be striving to improve. But if you can get certain parts, especially your, your person, to that level, um, I think you'll find that life will be easier, you're comfortable, you'll feel more comfortable in your own skin. Um, and you're, you'll be confident to know that, hey, this is who I am. This is the the last evolution of my, I shouldn't say the last, actually, this is the highest evolution of my personality in person. Um, and I'm open to additional suggestions, but I'm, I had, I'm on a plateau where I'm good. Um, and that's where I'm just starting to walk into now. Um, you know, as far as like worrying about what people say or think or what they want you to do or always having to do stuff for people. Um, that you, you get to a spot like I am now and you, you let all that go. It's, you know, not your job to worry about what people want to think or how they want to perceive you or take you as. You be the best person you can be. And if you can truly look at yourself and go, I'm good in all those areas, like I'm, I'm fair, I'm open-minded, uh, all these things, um, then you found you. Now, the main part of this is about how to, not really necessarily how to do this, but one way to do that. Now, in reading this book by Edgar Cayce, uh, and it talks about reprogramming yourself, I've noticed there's a small growing thing on YouTube where a lot of people are um, recording themselves, telling themselves the things that they need to hear. Okay, so for instance, uh, you're providing yourself with affirmations such as, um, I am loved, I am cared for, I am protected, I am blessed, I am wealthy, I am financially abundant, um, 
I am smart, I am fun, I'm witty, I have outgoing personality, I've got friends, um, you know, things of that nature, all the things you want to hear, um, because once you record these things, first of all, you're opening the door, because you, most people don't ever tell themselves these things, um, but these are things that successful people do. Once you do them and you record them and you listen to them as you fall asleep or uh, as you meditate or take a nap or uh, whatever else, your own body and soul, when you hear these things, are going to um, recognize your voice and you're providing an input of energy. It's kind of like the old saying, you know, you are what you eat, you are what you take in. So if you're always watching negative bad things and hearing negative things and you're like, oh, I, I never will win the lottery or whatever else, um, you probably won't. If you're saying, if you keep going around saying, you know, I'm thinking to yourself and listening to these affirmations and saying, you know, hey, I'm a positive person, I am very fortunate, I'm lucky, I'm blessed, I'm protected, um, you're going to have a greater chance of that energy affecting you in a positive way than uh, than, than the negative stuff because the negative stuff will always be there and even through all the positive things you do in your life there's still going to be some you can't escape all of it but you can definitely minimize it by putting up this energy within you and kind of creating an invisible shield of energy around your person and your finances and your loved ones and things of that nature so and you can put it to some um, uh, binarial beats, you know, like some energy. Um, just look up like healing, um, soul, soul, uh, what is it? Philagio uh, beats and healing frequencies. Um, put that in the background. Record yourself telling you all the things that you want to, you know, be. And when you get time, listen to it fall asleep to it utilize it um, reprogram yourself find a way to make yourself better and uh, even if other people aren't there for you to do these things you need to be there for you and maybe for your family or friends or loved ones or whatever else so uh, invest in you and hopefully this technique will help you guys if not maybe get a better night of sleep I don't know um, for me, definitely, I, I've listened to tons of frequencies and things of that nature, and what I'm telling you right now is something that I'm starting, so we'll see how that works. Maybe I'll do an update and let you know how things have prospered, um, hopefully for me, in the next 30 days, and I'll try to listen to it almost every day uh, and see what happens. But staying positive, oh, one last thing. So yeah, they did this research where they talk to uh, negatively and positively to plants um, and negatively and positively into uh, water and then the, with the water they froze the water and the results for both blind studies um, were the same everything that they spoke negative energy to and about or whatever else was either the water froze in weird patterns the plant had brown leaves and the ones that they spoke positive things to um, all did you know as they should grew and were you know beautiful looking and symmetric so don't forget there's power in your words and for those people who are of faith um, don't forget that uh, God spoke the uh, universe and everything into existence um, you know so so you say or so so you speak so you shall have or so it'll be so mote it be um, so there's power and energy in your words they're not just words it's energy, literally. Everything's made out of energy, so as you're listening to this, this is energy. This is positive energy um, I'm promoting to you. So promote yourself, and uh, for those people out there who might need a little help, I wish you nothing but positive energy and blessings, and uh, speak highly and positively of your good friends who, you know, and, and actually even of those people who are negative, you know, wish them that um, they do better in life and that hopefully they find the path towards um, salvation and a greater good um, for them for themselves and if they have to go through negative or positive or in the combination thereof to become that better person then so would it be that's about it guys just a short quick video on that so don't be afraid to uh, reprogram yourself and uh, enjoy life and look for deeper meanings and things and uh, believe in yourself and uh, 
believe in God or whatever faith you believe in. So, all right, take care, guys. Later.